Hi, in this particular video we've been asked to simplify this algebraic fraction. Okay, so really the key skill that you need with this is factorising. And you need to be able to have a look at both the numerator and the denominator and be able to factorise them. Okay, so if we have a look at the top one here, I can factorise that to two bracketed terms. One is x there and then I look at two numbers that when I multiply them together will make minus 6. Well those two numbers in this particular case are going to be plus 3 and minus 2. Now the reason that is is because if I have plus 3 and minus 2 here which I'm going to multiply together I can also add them together to make this plus 1 so I need to multiply the minus 6 and then add them together to make the plus 1 multiply and add. If you're not sure about how I've done that, then please do have a look at some of the other videos on factorising, um, because that's one of the main skills that you need for this particular type of question. So the top factorising will be x plus 3 brackets x minus 2. Okay, so the bottom one, I'm going to go in exactly the same way. I'm going to look at that plus 10. I'm going to say what two numbers, when I multiply them together, will make plus 10, and when I add them together, will make minus 7. So those two numbers are actually going to be minus 5 and minus 2. So you've got to remember with factorising sometimes when you're multiplying two numbers together both of them are negative to make a positive number. Okay, um, if we have a look at this particular fraction it then allows me to cancel out the x minus 2 terms and I can rewrite the fraction in its simplified form as x plus 3 divided by x minus 5. And actually, that's the end and that's the, that's the answer to this particular question. Um, it should be fairly straightforward, provided you can factorise, but please do have a look at some of the more challenging um, simplification of algebraic fractions in the next video and throughout the rest of this playlist. I hope that's okay. Please do add a comment below. I'll always come back to you and I'll look forward to seeing you inside the next video.